to Alex on. Hey, buddy. You want to have a dialogue real quick? Come tell us why Trump's racist. Why is Trump racist? I'm married to a Mexican who's a legal immigrant. We're working on his papers, but we both agree that Trump is not a racist. He's dealing with the immigration problem. You see what's going on in uh, Paris, you know, with all these terrorist attacks. We can't just let everybody in. I mean, we got we got to vet these people. We got to stop what's going on. He's he's not doing this to to do it against Mexicans. He's doing it against everybody right now. It's not just Mexicans. It's Islamist people. It's, I mean, it's Chinese. It's anybody. We got to stop. We got to vet these people from coming in. And I mean. People, that, that's the only words y'all can always say is Trump is KKK. What's your view on Planned Parenthood? No view on Planned Parenthood? Well, um, if you're for it, just so you know, Margaret Singer standing in front of them uh, preaching about how they want to get rid of the black people. So, Trump's not a racist. Trump's not a racist. So come on, tell us why you think Trump's a racist. We want to talk about the details, man. Yeah. What about the facts? How come, how come you guys can only say he's a racist, but y'all can't talk about the facts? Why is that? Yeah, tell, just tell us why you think he's yeah, racist. You're just quiet, man. You got to tell, what's your views on it? Let, let us know your views. We're not doing this to yeah, be yeah. mean. Yeah, yeah, no, we want to hear your views. Yeah, we want to know why you think he's a racist. You're out here with a sign, well, man. Why can't yeah, you explain why, why is he a racist? Racist is just a word. So, yeah. So he's just another trendy pointing at the sign like they always say, <laughs> you know, they always say Trump is a racist, Trump is a racist, but they won't respond with the facts. That's what always happens. These same old trendies do this, and this guy's older and he's doing this. Usually you expect the college kid to do this, but that's why y'all got to spread the word. That's why y'all got to let all your college friends know and start letting them know the facts because this right here this is propaganda this right th this guy doesn't have any facts he doesn't know what to talk about because all he could say is just like the liberals Trump is a racist Trump is a racist but it's not true this guy needs to do his research and look at his facts because like I said I'm married to a Mexican who is illegal and we're working on his papers but I don't agree that everyone should be flooding in our country they're gonna bankrupt us and then we're also gonna get terrorist attacks in almost all the major cities just like over there across seas I mean, look at Europe. They're, they're a failed country right now. It's a failed state. And that's the way they want us to be. They want a globalist system. Y'all guys need to wake up. This guy needs to wake up and realize that the globalists are taking over. And this is what he's brainwashed into doing. That's brainwashed right there. So come on, guys. Wake up. How do you respond? Do you have anything to say? He doesn't have a brain. He's not a We got to wake these people up. We got to wake these people up. You got you got to come with a couple talking points next time, so at least you have something to say. Yeah, man. You're making well, yourself look like a fool. That, that's all the, the Trump we haters. Hear man. From you. I mean, that's any anybody who just says he's a racist. Okay. That that's they're all like that. They have no facts. It seems like racist if you don't agree with me. That's what. Yeah, exactly. It's it's my opinion only, and that's it. And nobody else has an opinion. Nobody else has freedoms. Only them. Only the establishment. But that's why we gotta vote Trump. We gotta stand up. And this is my first protest, but I'm out here. I'm doing it for everybody. Keep talking. You know, this, this is my first protest. I'm 21 years old, but I got my ass out here from Colorado Springs through all the traffic, and I represent Donald Trump because you gotta look at the facts. You gotta, you gotta get up and tell your family, tell your friends, come on out here, guys, and start protesting. Show them signs. Write them bumper stickers. Write on the back of your car what you support, and let people know. Hell yeah. Facebook, all that. We got social media. Spread the word. YouTube, make your own channel. Make your own Facebook. Make Instagram. Do whatever you got to do to spread the word, guys. It's important. We're going to get our freedom and our country taken away from us. We're going to get it stripped right up from under us because we're not thinking. We're not being smart. We got to wake up. We can't be like this guy. We can't be brainwashed. And we have to have the facts. How about that? Yeah. What's up? Destabilized Africa. Don't play. Don't play with me. You're wearing that shirt, man. She, she, you know. I'm sorry about that, man. But uh, Hillary, Hillary Clinton is the one. Uh, Hillary Clinton is the one that destabilized Africa. She had more and more uh, Gaddafi murdered in two thousand back into uh, two thousand eleven. You know. Hey, 